This protocol is significant because it provides a specific microinjection method for Anopheles gambiae, which has been historically difficult to transform using common genetic engineering techniques. The main advantage of this technique is that it reliably creates transgenic Anopheles gambiae. The implications of this technique extend toward novel strategies for malaria elimination by facilitating the creation of mosquitoes suitable for population suppression or modification of wild-type Anopheles gambiae populations. This methodology can be adapted easily to different mosquito species. All microinjection technology take patience and practice. There is a learning curve. To begin, use an aspirator to place 20 to 30 females in a transparent 50 milliliter conical tube. Ensure the tube is cut open at both ends and is covered with latex dental film at one end and nylon mesh and filter paper at the other, where mosquitoes will lay their eggs. Place the mosquito-filled tube in a small petri dish filled with double distilled water. Then place the tube and dish in an incubator at 28 degrees Celsius for 45 minutes. Remove the tube from the incubator and insert the tube into an empty cage. Gently tap the tube to allow mosquitoes to fly out. Remove the tube from the cage once all the mosquitoes have flown out. When the tube is free of mosquitoes, unscrew the bottom ring, remove the nylon, and use forceps to carefully remove the filter paper with the eggs from the tube. Place the egg-laden filter paper in a plastic petri dish containing a layer of filter paper moistened with water. Put a membrane on a clean glass.